Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. Today I thought I would show you what I put in my pencil case when I have exams at university. The first thing to start off is with a clear pencil case. This one is by Oxford, it's just a standard clear pencil case and this is a new one. The one I used to have was the same one but it had a pink strap instead but I've had that since I was in year 7 so I thought maybe it's time I got a new one. It's clear see-through so you can show this to the invigilator before you go in and it should be totally fine. If you prefer you can bring a bigger pencil case but I find for me personally it's not necessary because I can fit everything into this. Since I am in university and I do physics I don't need to bring things like a compass or a protractor or set squares and things like that because I just don't need it for my exam so I won't be carrying those with me but of course if you need those then you can put them in. The first thing I like to pack is a ballpoint pen. I love these pens by Eni Ball. They are absolutely amazing and I've been using these for I want to say over a year now and I think they are absolutely amazing and these are the smoothest ballpoint pens I have ever used. This is the Jetstream Edition pen so I like to put one of these in first of all. This is how the pen looks, it's a super nice pen, smooth body, matte feel so it's good for grip and through these clear things you can actually see how much ink is left, it's got a nice clicker and it fits in my hand really really well. I think it's absolutely perfect for exams if you like biros. So let's put that in. The next thing I like to put into my pencil case are some gel slash ink pens. These ones are really, really good. Again, these are by Uniball and these are the eye needle pens. And I really like this one because it doesn't smudge if water spills on your work and the ink is so consistent and really, really smooth. So I really like this for that purpose. I have been using these pens as well for over a year now. You can see it in loads of my vlogs. I use it all the time. So I like to take one of this and put that as well. Another pen item that I really like are these pens. These are absolutely amazing. Again, I have been using these for over a year and I've used these to write many of my exams in. They are so smooth the way they write. I like this because it actually makes your handwriting a lot bolder because of its bigger tip size and it basically gives you like a fountain pen effect without having to use a fountain pen. I think it's really, really pretty, easy to grip, nice to hold. Um, it looks like this. It's really, really smooth to write with and it's a very comfortable experience as well. You can write a lot with this pen without your hand hurting and also fits in my hand really nicely. Next thing that I definitely, definitely have to bring to an exam is a calculator. This one is the Casio Classwiz calculator. I got this when I was in sixth form and this calculator is amazing because it can solve polynomial equations, simultaneous equations, it's got all the statistics functions inbuilt. So for example, Poisson distribution, binomial distribution, normal distribution, it's got everything stored inside here. You can store values very easily and yeah, it's just an amazing, amazing calculator. So I always bring this one with me and the buttons are really smooth to press and it's really, really easy to use. So. Yep, I always bring this with me. However, for my exams, I have never been allowed to bring the back of my calculator lid, so I just bring the actual calculator itself. I like to bring a pencil with me all the time. This one is by Stedler. I absolutely love this pencil. I have been using these pencils ever since I was in year seven. They write so smoothly. They fit in the hand really nicely as well. And this is really good when you want to draw diagrams and stuff before you outline them in your biro or your ink pen. Because in my physics classes, a lot of the time we have to draw diagrams for like star systems and different things like that. So using a pencil is always a good option because then you can rub it out if you make a mistake or something. And when you're finished with your pencil drawing, you can go over in pen so that it will scan nicely. So yeah, I really like this pencil and it's really, really good. The next thing I like to bring is a highlighter. I usually just bring two highlighters in case I need them, but 
I normally find that I don't end up using both of them so I've just converted to bringing one highlighter with me. I like this one because it's pastel so even if I do highlight too much I can still see what's written underneath. Just make sure you never highlight your actual work with your highlighter. Only use a highlighter to highlight parts of the question that you want to maybe stand out because when it scans this can make it a lot more difficult to read but I always bring a highlighter so I can keep parts out that I want to stand out. I also like to bring a coloured pen with me. This one is the same as the black one that I showed you before, but it's in green. And I find this quite useful when I want to quickly annotate something. I often, again, don't really use this, but I bring it just in case I need it. Because when I write in green, I know that's not part of my final answer. So usually I'll just use this if I want to annotate anything. And you can see the tip here is like this. It's very, very fine. Hopefully you can see that if I do that is 0.5 millimeters and again super super easy to hold nice to write with and super comfortable i always bring a ruler this one is a foldable 30 centimeter ruler this one is really good because you can just fold it so it'll fit into your pencil case and also since it's clear you can see right through it onto your question paper so if you need to measure anything out you know that you're going to do it well i bought this when i was in year 12 and it still works so i use it still and the final thing I bring in my exam pencil case is a rubber. This one has been well and truly used. You can see I've used it a lot. I've been using this since I was in year 12. I got this in my sick form when I joined basically. Um, and it still works so I just bring a rubber. Any rubber will do. And this again is for when I use my pencil, when I do drawings and stuff. To just rub it out if it goes wrong or if I don't need it anymore. So I always bring this. Now this is basically everything that I bring with me into the exam. I also bring two spare pens, I normally bring two biros and the purpose of this is in case any of my friends or someone that I know has forgotten a pen then I can just let them use it. Um, so yeah I normally bring two in case anyone else needs a pen. And um, like I said, I don't bring protractor or compass with me to my exams because I don't need them. But if you did need them, then I would recommend these ones. I got this protractor um, when I was in sick form as well. It, it was basically a set by Oxford. Um, maybe you can see a bit clearer here. It looks like this. So yeah, that's everything I take with me to my exam. If you enjoyed or found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up and also hit the subscribe button because it really helps me out over on this channel and leave a comment down below if you bring these things to your exams as well and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!